This might be my favorite song by Jason. Y'all know what it is. It's your boy Amari, and I'm back. But today I'm doing something a little different. See, the way this goes, the way this goes, I had originally planned to drop a reaction video to Screwface John's The Endgame Game Dax Disc. Why? Because Screw is fire and Dax is not. But I woke up this morning with a demo from none other than Jason, lowercase j, with a period. So, of course, you know what we gonna do. You know what we have to do. You know this gotta be the first reaction because there's nothing else that can be the first reaction. So let's just jump right into it. Let's see what my boy Jason got for us this time. Always making fire music. Always making dope beats. Always laying down some nice tracks. Some nice lines. I see you, boy, with your songwriter ability. With your penmanship getting into your bag. Let's see what you got for us today, Jay. Let's see. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. He started the track with this little voiceover thing. It's kind of like it's his, his his inner head or something, or almost as if he is talking from the perspective of somebody else. I thought that that was really dope. What I caught was, it's way past time. I should have done this a long fucking time ago. Like, I, I got to restart that from the beginning, check it out, see what he's talking about. But um, I, I, I think that's dope. I, I really do. I want to see what this track is about. Okay, the clap. I can see this in concert. Tell me honestly, does it feel like it's over? Okay, one thing I can tell for sure right now just by listening to it, I can tell that it's not finished, which I like. I like that he's sending it to me unfinished, just so I can get a rough idea of what's going on with this track. But to be honest, just from listening to the very beginning of this track, I already like where it's going. I like just those those somber vocals he has. It's it's almost as if he's struggling. It's almost as if he's grasping at something. Um, like, so far, this song got me really, really, really into it. And um, I can't wait to see what's next. I can do again. Tell me. Ooh, those, 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 um, the guitar, or not guitar, the piano, the piano strings in this song remind me of, I can't think of what song it is, but I, it just sounds so very familiar, but I really like the chord that he's playing on the uh, piano, it sounds really nice, it complements the, the beat really well in my opinion, um, I don't think it's, I don't think it's too much, I don't think it's too little, um, I want to see what he does with that. Just like I want to see what he does with this whole song. Um, I I know Jason very well, and Jason is not the type of person that would just leave the beat like this. That would just leave the song like this. Of course, he's gonna give you more. So I can't wait to see what more he's actually going to give us. Alright, it feels like it's building. I 
So was his voice. Okay. What I really like so far about this track is just like he I know Jason Jason is a close personal friend of mine so what I like here is that he's like actually pouring out his heart man like you can tell just from the way he's singing you can tell from the lyrics that that, that this is something that is really that's really impacting him um when the when, when when the beat really dropped after that like the build up was a little bit slow but what i liked about it is that it it went from like almost nothing to like relatively a major production but when the beat really drops like that that it it, it just sent shivers up and down my spine this this is very much i guess a, a neo or usher type song or, or 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 vibe that i'm getting from this song um I say that because with Usher, you know, you generally have the the songs where he's starting off trying to explain something, starting off trying to get a message across, whatever, whatever, whatever. But then when the beat really comes in, you know, it's it, it, it's really you get to feel his emotion that he's trying to bring into the song. You really get to uh, like, for example, in Confessions or Let It Burn or 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 just any of those songs. Um, if you listen to them the way the song builds and then once it gets sort of towards the middle and the beat really drops you see usher go crazy you see him do these runs you see his, you see the production value of the song jump up all that gets um why i say neo is because neo is known for these really i guess he's known for these songs where where you know the beat may be just a little bit more simple, but you know he adds layers to it, and then once he adds his vocal on top of those layers, then you really have like a production. For example, if you take one in a million, that was really, really, really a simple song. Um, but what uh, Neo did was he just added layers on top of it. He added a few more layers on top of it. He put his vocals on it, and then layered his vocals on top of each other. Um, and it really just filled out the song, but he didn't really need much to do it. Um, and, and that's why I say I'm getting Neo Usher vibes because um, with this song here, I am really, really, really starting to feel just, just like, all right, what's next? I'm starting to, I'm starting to feel like, all right, man, give me those runs, like really make me feel this. And I'm like just getting really excited to see how he brings it all back in. We're about halfway through the song now. This might be my favorite song by Jason. Just because you can tell how hard he's trying, just because the the, the, the result what it sounds sonically it just sounds so good to me um i i very much so am a fan of this brand of r&b and i am very much so a fan of uh i guess i guess i'm just a fan of of people sharing everything that they have on the track it just makes me feel like it just makes me feel like they're actually giving it their all All right, y'all, that was Questions, the demo version by Jason. It's going to be a hit from your boy. It's going to be a major, major, major hit from your boy. I honestly think that this is a fantastic song, and I can't wait to see the finished version if this was just the demo. I can't wait to see what other genius 
genius Jedi mind tricks our boy Jason got for us. I can't wait to see everything else that our boy Jason got for us. I'm excited. I don't know what's next, but I'm excited. So Jason, quit playing with us, bro. Drop the full thing. Drop the full thing.